The race is on to give an extra 1.7 million Brits COVID jabs as the shielding list is extended. More clinically extremely vulnerable people will be bumped up the list to get the vaccine as their status letters sent out have also told the group to now shield until March 31st. The initial end date was February 21st. Dr. Jenny Harris today said the group will receive the additional support including medicine deliveries, priority slots for supermarkets and statutory. She said, we have a new, evidence-based, data-driven, predictive risk model which allows us to identify adults with multiple risk factors that make them more vulnerable to COVID-19. We can now identify additional people and help protect them now and in the future. For the first time, we are able to go even further in protecting the most vulnerable in our communities. This new model is a tribute to our health and technology researchers. The model's data-driven approach to medical risk assessment will help the NHS identify further individuals who may be at high risk from COVID-19 due to a combination of personal and health factors. Those within this group who are over 70 will have already been invited for vaccination and 820,000 adults between 19 and 69 years will now be prioritized for a vaccine. Around 2.2 million people are currently on the list in England many of whom were identified for a single reason, such as specific cancers, people on immunosuppression drugs or those with severe respiratory conditions. New priority groups The additional 1.7 million will bring the number on the list to almost four. The new shielders will be contacted by their GP once they have been identified and invited for a vaccine. The jab list, determined by the JCVI, Joint Committee on Vaccination and Immunization, put the elderly and care workers at the top of the so far over 15 million Brits have received a first dose of either the Oxford slash AstraZeneca jab or the Pfizer slash BioNTech offering, with over half a million having received their second. It comes as COVID jabs are poised to double to a million a day to get all over 50s vaccinated by the end of April. The pledge came as Prime Minister Boris Johnson said last night the lifting of lockdown would be cautious but irreversible so families and businesses can have certain daily COVID cases have plummeted to the lowest number since October. He added that Brits should be patient but optimistic their lives will soon be set on a gradual path back. Britain's world-leading vaccine program has smashed its target to vaccinate 15 million by but Boris said there should be no ease up and the nation must power on to immunise all 32 million over 50s by the end. NHS England boss Sir Simon Stevens pledged to double jab numbers to hit the milestone, meaning they could hit him. The PM hailed the unprecedented national achievement on vaccines, but warned, it is no moment to relapse.